I think um, certainly we're observing thermal heating um, and bleaching events happening at more regular frequencies than they have in the past. And that makes it very difficult for reefs to uh, have sufficient time to recover and grow back in between these disruptive events. also saw that this effect decreased as you got farther away from the speaker. So we had higher amounts of settlement in our cups that were closer to the speaker compared to far away. And so that all gave us um, some indication that it was the manipulation of the acoustic field that was resulting in this changed behavior. The next step is maybe trying to see how sound interacts with these other factors and how, you know, how much you can compensate for other deficiencies in the environment by adding sound back, but also opportunities to do it in the lab with coral restoration efforts that are rearing corals in nurseries, you know, in, in labs, in tanks, and trying to grow them onshore before outplanting them.